Business Bites, powered by Sajikor. Hello, I'm Cody and Barrett with the Jamaica Observer's Business Bites for Wednesday, November 8. Pepsi Cola Jamaica unveiled its new production line, Line 9, on Tuesday, which represents a 22 million US dollar investment. Completed in just eight months, the production line is set to boost Pepsi's production capacity by 60%. According to Luz Tejada, commercial manager of Pepsi, the company recognized the need to catch up in serving the entire market, which prompted the investment. So we have a lot of product that we were to fill, like especially like the local product like tea, ginger beer. We had to choose which one to produce and mainly is Pepsi. So now with this, we have to make the investment. It was a really hard decision because we were maybe not prepared right now to do it, but we have to do it in order to remain competitive and be the leader that we are in the market. According to Mr. Jara, the aim now is to boost Pepsi's distribution target locally by 20%. It also plans to increase production of its other beverage lines as well. Well, now that we have this line, we're thinking, okay, because Gatorade and Ocean Spray, Tropicana, some premium juice, we don't produce it in this type of line. So we're thinking that in short term we need a new line because we're almost at capacity in that line. So we're thinking to make more investment. I'm not sure if it's going to be here in Kingston, but we are open to spy in different places in Jamaica. In the meantime, Prime Minister Andrew Holness addressed a controversial concern among Jamaicans regarding the possible hiring of foreign workers. This concern arises from calls by the private sector suggesting that if Jamaica's economic growth continues at its current pace, a controlled and increased entry of overseas workers may be needed to supplement the local workforce. Mr. Holness assured the public that this is not a new phenomenon, as various growth strategies have been employed in the past. He also pointed out that neighboring countries have implemented similar measures and Jamaica may need to do the same. You know, there are various estimates as to the actual pool of labor that is outside the form of labor force. If we continue to grow and our growth pace increases, we will use up those who are outside. Maybe in the next five years, six years, maybe in the next decade, we would have thought 10 years ago that Jamaica would be at this place now. But you can't wait until you are at that point in the future that you make policies for that time. You just have to be thinking ahead and that's why you have this government. He made the remark during the opening of the Pepsi Cola Jamaica's new production line ribbon cutting ceremony on Tuesday. And that's it for the Business Bites today. I'm Cody Ann Barrett.